type. Can everyone pull out their fill, uh, pull out their smartphone phones, please? Or if you have a tablet, smartphone tablet. Okay. We're going to look at how this ideal type affects what people see when it comes to Muslims. All right. So that's our next one. We're going to play American Muslim Google. Oh, not supposed to be that. American Muslim Google. So can everyone pull out their smartphone and open up Google? All right. Now, the first thing you're going to put in, please Google the word Muslim. You're laughing already. Do you know what it is? <laughs> images. Yes, please press images. Sorry, I forgot that one directive. Oops. Donald Trump is like the seventh image. Okay, God, glad to have you on board, Donald. <laughs> okay, so everyone pretty much got this, right? All right, let's look at the first five to ten, or the first two rows of images. Okay. Did Eddie raise your hand if you do not see a representation of yourself in any of these images? Okay. All right. Not see a representation of yourself in any of these images. All right. All right. Now, Google uh, Google American Muslim and hit images. Are you comfortable there? <laughs> Did you say really? Yes. She's like, are you serious? Are you kidding me? <laughs> All right. So did everyone pretty much get this? Okay, American Muslim. I love the flag part of it. Yeah. I find that very interesting. Okay, another raise of hands. If you do not see a representation of yourself outside your religion. They don't see a lot of people. They don't see representations of themselves. Okay. Let me ask you a question. What, uh, as, what ethnicities or races do you see? First of all, there's Linda Sassor. Linda's awesome, so let's ignore Linda. <laughs> okay, because Linda totally rocks. All right, so, so we see Arab, what we would think was Arab, but we already know that they're black Arabs, so we automatically think Arab. What else? Do we see kind of like what we think of Daisy, South Asian? Okay. Do we see any black people? Do we see any white people? Do we see any Southeast Asians? Do we see any East, East Asians? Are there black Muslims? Are there white Muslims? Are there East Asian Muslims? Are there Southeast Asian Muslims? Here in the United States. But that's what you get. Okay. So now, Google American Muslim convert. No, real interesting. <laughs> Let's look at the first top two rows. What do we see? Just white people. That's it. Now, are the majority of American Muslim converts white people? What's the majority of American Muslim converts? Afro-Americans. Are there famous Afro-American Muslims? Yeah. Well, where the heck are they? All right, I don't see Dave Chappelle. I don't see Muhammad Ali. I don't see Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Okay, Betty Shabazz. All right, Malcolm X. Where are they? Three quarters of the American Muslim convert population identify as black or African-American. But they're not here. Yes. Well, that's true too. Well, that's true too because the the, the hijab has been highly politicized. And if you want to have that ideal type, okay, isn't the covered Muslim woman the most oppressed? Yes, according to that ideal type. So that's what you're going to see. But the interesting thing here is that you don't see any kind of, you don't see the diversity that actually exists in American Muslim communities. Okay. I mean, some, yes, some are more isolated and have more of a dominant uh, ethnicity, but there are quite a few diverse ones. Now, the thing is, is that if I'm someone that is not Muslim and I type in these things, what am I going to start developing? I'm going to start developing in my mind an ideal type of what a Muslim is. 
okay? And if I want to, I can start targeting those people. All right, what if I'm a Muslim that um, 